Glorious day for our move to Portugal. should be able to cover my absence. Do you feel as if you betrayed you? I mean, cough is one thing. But to destroy everything that I ever believed in? For that alone, I, I have to call Ramsey out. I want to be there when his little empire of cards dumps on him. I'll never forgive him. Not ever for what he did to my town. My old department. But more importantly, what he did to my family. I'll make him pay. I'll make him pay if I have to die trying. But you know, I've got to have the answer to one question. I want to know why he did it. And I want to hear it from his voice. Look. Certainly quiet up there. It should be. I had the whole area vacated. The next sound you hear will be the jeep, the mob's loot. And after that, anything could happen. Go along for the good guy. 
That's Peter, my friend. What's that way, buddy? I'd love to see Pilgrim's face when he realizes he lost all his cash. <laughs> Robert and Anna are rolling in the dough now. Monte Carlo, Cayman Islands. Istanbul is stuff from everywhere. Everything we need to nail them up. Well, this doesn't prove them all. They're up to their ears and laundering money. Nothing. All right, Anna. I want you to dust. Hey, right, I want to get back to the luncheon. I'll send some people out to help with the transfer. Yeah, I know it's rough. Yeah. What? We got a few more tricks up our sleeve. Unbelievable amounts of cash. I think it's all dirty, too. When I think of what, what must have been done to earn this sort of money and how it would have corrupted Port Charles, it makes me sick. Now, the mob couldn't care less. No, they couldn't. They don't care where they laundered their money. And you were part of this. You want me to apologize for doing what I had to do? Why, well, don't Doesn't it bother you having handled this bill? No, I try not to think about it. Oh, come on. I did what I had to do to survive. You don't think I'm proud of it, do you? I guess I never figured the consequences were so harmful to others. What did you think it was, a charity organization? I always considered myself to be apart from the real crime. Yes, I worked for them, but I did not do the dirty jobs. It's convenient where you draw the line, isn't it? But I suppose those, those standards could be lowered as well. You don't understand how the mob operates. Oh, of course I do. I'm chief of police. I've had first-hand experience of how they operate. I've seen what little regard they have for human life. I never came in contact with the victims. The people who were broken by the mob's rule. The people who supplied the money that I laundered. No, the innocents brutalized by the criminals. Entire mob empires are built on the ruination of people like that. It doesn't matter whether you pull the trigger or whether you supply the means by which the bullets are bought. You're still guilty. I know that. And what's happened doesn't absolve me of any responsibility. But at least I have helped to break the mob. And there will be nobody more happy than I to see them fall. <laughs> Fair day's work done? Yes. We pulled it off. We crippled the mob. Best part about it is they don't even know. Come out. Come out. It's headquarters. What, is that bad? Well, it is. I told them only to contact me in an emergency. Go ahead, HQ. Scott tried to revive him, but it was too late. Who's dead? David Grenville. At first, it appeared to be a heart attack, but traces of poison were found in his blood. Damon's dead? Um, message confirmed, out. The mob must have got on then. Yeah. That means they're on to us. Since they know that Damon's death is a fake, then they also must know that Frisco's a plant. To the end. He and Sean are walking straight into a trap now. If they haven't already, I've got to get down to the bank. I'm going to come with No, no, you stay here. Which bank is it? It's a new one in the Fisherman's Village. You can't go down there on your own. I have to. Frisco and Sean won't get out there alive if I don't do something. Anna. Anna. Let me go, please. I want to go to the bank. Please. Will you listen to me? Bank. No, listen. I want to go to the bank and warn Sean and Frisco or else this whole plan's going to be destroyed. And so will you if you rush right in there. I'll take this chance. Do you think you can run in and surprise the mob? Anna, it's too late for that. They're ready I'm for right. anything and everything. Listen to me. Get out of my way. Oh. Oh. Sorry. Rather me than you. danger. I think the mob are onto us. How do you know? Um, because uh, headquarters called me. Uh, they got on, on the walkie-talkie and they said that um, Damon's dead. For real? Yeah. He was poisoned. 
If the mob knows that Damon was alive, then they're going to know Frisco's working under No, her. no, not necessarily. Don't panic. Uh, now I've got to get to the bank. I've got to warn Frisco and Sean. I, uh, my car's outside. I know a shortcut. I'll get there. Okay, I'm coming with you. No, you must stay here. You must stay here and wait for the cops because I want you to help them move the money. Just as we planned. Right? Is Duke with us or is he against us? I wish I knew. Now you stay here. Stay here with the money. I've got to believe that you didn't sell out on us. <laughs> 